Isn't it amazing how life is one thing and then in an instant, just like that, it becomes something else? Mom! Dad! What's happening? Am I gonna die? How am I supposed to find the strength to stay? There had been a question that had sort of been inside of me for years, and it was, what would you do if you were hovering between life and death? Here's the secret, baby. You control this whole thing. I read the book and was captivated by the universal message of how we journey on in the face of great tragedy. If you live, if you die, it's all up to you. So whatever fight you got in you, you got to pull it out now. It's all about the deepest connections we have with the people we love. I was just so moved. I was kind of shattered by it and thought I really want to make this movie. If I Stay is one of those really popular young adult novels that everyone was reading. I picked up the book immediately and I loved it. You can't hide in that rehearsal room forever. It's too late. I see you. I read the script, I really liked it, and I think that we have all the things in the movie that so many fans loved about the book. If I Stay is about this 17-year-old cellist named Mia. She's got kind of an unusual life. She's got these parents who used to be punk rockers, but she's this sort of very serious cellist. We made that. And she's in love with this guy, and he's also a rock musician. Adam is obsessed with music. In his school, I guess a lot of people know him as the guy who's in this band that everyone really likes. He's this up-and-coming Portland rocker who's, you know, sexy. And then you have this girl who's playing cello and wanting to go to Juilliard. He kind of brings into her life the crazy, wild, do-anything-in-the-moment kind of feeling. Adam, it's a combination of swagger and vulnerability. You believe that Mia would fall in love with a guy like this. Hey, I got some tickets to see a cellist. Really? Adam's here. Kids, be careful out there. Here it gets pretty wild at the symphony. They both share one love, which is music. That's what brings two together. He recognizes that they have a connection, and he feels himself falling in love with her. It's just two completely separate worlds. Why do I have this feeling you're about to mess up my entire life? A little mess never hurt anybody. It's causing a bit of a tug of war in her life. What do I know, Ray? You know plenty. It's just very inconvenient to fall in love at your age. It kind of captures that heartbreaking combination of like youth and hope and potential. Do you like me better like this? The you you are now is the same you I was in love with yesterday, the same you I'll be in love with tomorrow. If I Stay is about the choices that we make in life and the way our lives are changed by who we love. I live, if I die, it's all up to me. If I stay is the major question that you're asking throughout the entire movie. Do I stay, do I live for love, or do I go with my family? Saying goodbye. If you want to go, I want you to know it's okay. Say something, I'm giving up on you. I will do anything if you stay. Even though she's lost so much, there is something left. You still have a family, Mia. Say something, I'm giving up on you. What am I supposed to do? Sometimes you make choices in life, and sometimes choices make you. Oh, I can't lose her. Say something, I'm Why me? Up on you. Life is this big, fat, gigantic, stinking mess. That's the beauty of it, too. I'm still here, and I'm crazy in love with you. Please stay. Say something, I'm giving up on you.